Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back. It's somebody Techno Boy, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can make a, a passive bus radiator at your home. Well, most of you already know that what a passive bus radiator is, and it's for them uh, who don't know that yet. A passive radiator is just uh, looks like this. It's kind of speaker. Uh, looking thing from the front side uh, from back side is just the cone and the surroundings and nothing else no uh, coil no spider no magnet and uh, no basket also so why do we uh, why we are going to use this uh, we use this for uh, to replace the bus from the other side uh, of the enclosure bus enclosure like you'll get uh, you'll see three kind of enclosure like sealed enclosure that uh, subwoofer is in a sealed completely sealed enclosure there's no air pipe or nothing like that and another one is uh, a ported enclosure there you'll get uh, one or two air pipe depending on the size of the enclosure and another the third one is the passive radiator and the one side you'll get the speaker driver the bus driver and the, the other side you'll get a passive radiator like this so it will uh, reflect the bus from the other side also so let me show you how you can make this at your home using uh, your old unused speaker or your blown up speaker by which uh, coil is blown already and you don't want to repair that you cannot use that so you can make a passive radiator using this kind of uh, speaker that you have useless for you so let me show you that I can make this there is one you can see it's a 3 inch uh, speaker driver okay so what you need to do is you need to cut uh, all around the basket from here to uh, remove the basket from the this front panel about the basket and the magnet so let's do it
and your work is done the passive radiator is ready to use as you can see it's just the front this uh, metal panel and the cone and the uh, surrounding that's it now you can use it with a 3 inch uh, subwoofer or 4 inch subwoofer uh, and that enclosure like that and uh, simply this was just a demonstration for <clears throat> making a passive radiator at home using your old unused uh, speaker like this you can make a bigger one uh, like 8 inch or 10 inch if you have a cheap 8 inch or 10 inch uh, driver at home that you don't use or it's uh, damaged or something like that then you can use that and make a passive radiator and then you can make a nice subwoofer uh, with a passive radiator that is going to give you a better sound okay so that's it guys hope you like the video and if you have any question and comments below and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.